Steel isn't strong, boy. Flesh is stronger. Look around you. If you don't know what I'm talking about, then you might not know the riddle of steel. And if you don't know the riddle of steel, well, aren't you going to be in for a treat today? Ah, uh, the riddle of steel. We start getting into one of my favorite movies as a kid, and that would be a movie that's not really a kid's movie. So, um, hey, thanks, Mom and Dad, for letting me watch that. And I actually mean that. Such a good movie. Talking, of course, about Conan the Barbarian. It's the only Conan movie that was ever made. It's a shame they didn't make any other Conan movies. Really missed out on that one, you know what I mean? Um, great premise, great idea, great world. Why didn't they make any other Conan movies? That's just... It's baffling to me. I just, I don't get it, you know? Whatever, I guess they thought one was enough. And crap, this tree isn't really ready to go. Anyway, as I said, we're going to be playing with steel today. That is on the game plan. And I thought I would get, well, I guess it doesn't matter. You know what? It doesn't matter. There was no need for me to do this. I just remembered how much coal we found on the last one, or the last couple, or whatever you want to say. And that was completely unnecessary. So you know what? My apologies. Hi, cat. Got a cat coming in to say hi. Here, let me see if I can get her to... There we go. You can see she is uh, trying to contemplate the idea, sort of, kind of, of getting comfortable. And I'm trying to hold her away from the microphone. That's actually what I'm doing when I'm doing that. I'm not just petting her, although that is, of course, in part what I'm doing, but not entirely. Anyway, why don't we go ahead and let's spend some points. So I've already typed in steel because I am ready to go on this. And there we go. We just got some steel. So now if we wanted to do something like, um, well, here, we can go over to the workbench and we could type in steel and we could just take a look at what it's going to cost. Five steel, five, five steel forged, five forged steel for that. Another five for that and another five for that. And then of course, a bunch of steel arrowheads to make a bunch of those. So I'm going to go ahead and say, we probably don't need to worry about the shovel right now. I technically have a steel shovel in the mini bike storage, but um, I want to say we don't need to worry about that. So why don't we go ahead and just whip out some forged steel here? Um, we're going to need a few of these guys. Cat, look at that. You're you're kind of cut off here. If I raise my leg, there you go. Now you can kind of join the audience. Here, let me let me just do those ten for right now, and then I'm going to go ahead. Wow, that's actually going to take most of our steel, <laughs> most of our iron. Oh, that is redonkulous. Uh, let's go ahead and dump the rest of that in there. And that's actually going to end up wiping out most of our clay, which means I should probably, um, I don't know, put half of that back in there. And then I think this one will end up being primarily for, I don't know, that sort of stuff. And maybe we'll put that in there. I, I don't really know. I'm kind of winging this in case it's not obvious. Let's see. I, I'm really actually kind of running low on some of this stuff. That's kind of a shame. Well, whatever. We shall survive or something. I don't know. Do I have... And I don't think I do, actually. Crap, I don't have a spiked club schematic. I do. Oh, okay. I just don't have forged iron. That's right. I remember that now. That That's kind of coming back to me now. So, wow, I can't see what I'm doing in, in type here. So if I go ahead and craft a couple of those guys, let's just whip those out. How are we doing... Looks like we might have been low on clay. I guess that's what the problem was with the steel. Let's see, what does that take? Oh yeah, it takes 10 clay. So let's do a bunch of steel arrowheads too. We can go ahead and do that. Um, can we do 99 of them? I guess we could do 130 of them. I'm totally on board with doing that many of them. We, we don't need to stick around for that today. That's not really my goal. But I am going to spend the time right here. And lucky for you, you don't actually have to sit here and wait. Well, I do this, but I'm going to go ahead and uh, make a couple steel things. There we go. We have ourselves a steel fire axe and a steel pickaxe. And actually, I want to say I might have a steel fire axe somewhere now that I'm thinking about it. And if I do, oh well. Oh well. I'm not going to uh, beat myself up over that one. Although I might want to get rid of a few of these springs just to kind of get some extra metal going in here. Uh, I guess I can't right now, so I, I won't worry about that. We don't really... Oh, yeah, actually, we do. Okay, well, cool. Let's go ahead and drop off some of this junk here. I'm going to go ahead and put you back in there. I'm going to leave our good old-fashioned steel, rather, iron tools behind. And we're just going to go ahead and rock the steel stuff. We're going to run with it. I mean, why not? We'll take some steel with us so we can go ahead and make some repairs. 
go ahead and repair this guy right now too, because it's looking pretty uh, pretty weathered. And then I think we're good to go. So I'm going to join you on the road, just dropping some of this stuff off, and uh, we'll see where we end up. I already know. You can take a guess. Welcome back to Deersville. Though I suppose some of you might say Dyersville. I'm going to stick with Deersville because that. Wow, hello. That's still a dog corpse lying there, I think. Anyway, you might recognize this building from several episodes ago. And if you don't, that little blue cross there ought to uh, give you a hand. So there are probably zombies aplenty around here. In fact, I would be surprised if there aren't. We're just going to go ahead and park about like so. And look at that, there aren't. <laughs> Alrighty then, well, good deal. Um, I can't tell what in the heck that is. I'm going to say we're going to go in, um, yeah, I guess right about here. That looks fine to me. Smash and smash. It would be nice if this particular fire axe were a little better, but I just haven't spent the time making a bunch of tools to, you know, kind of make all that stuff go easier. It just hasn't happened. So, you know, whatever. We'll run with it as, as is. It'll be fine. Oh, look at you. Aren't you fantastic? I'm assuming you're supposed to be an elevator shaft. This is my first time in the hospital, no kidding. So if I'm just kind of poking around a little bit and kind of noodling around, I hope you'll understand and forgive me a little bit. Don't really know where everything is. I will definitely check some beer coolers, though, just, just for giggles. I don't really have a whole lot of beer. I'm going to leave some of these things for right now. I actually meant to plant those tree seeds. Um, oops. Oh, well, whatever. It's not a big deal. Oh, look at you. A backpack just lying around. That's pretty fantastic. I'll go ahead and scrap that guy. Why not? Not necessarily even really looking for anything in particular. I'm really just kind of looking to, well, looking to just look around. Aha. How about that? No, I'm just, I really just kind of want to check things out and, you know, kind of enjoy this particular point of interest. This is a pretty cool building thus far. Oh, look at you. You're open to the courtyard. Oh, hi. And you would be looking to die. Die, my darling. Well, you're not really my darling, so whatever. Oh, there's a hornet nearby. In case. Oh, and there's a dog nearby. There's a wandering horde passing by. That's actually what's happening. Yeah, I think that's what that was. There's a dog somewhere. I don't know where you are, dog. You're over here. You're on that side of the wall. You're on the outside, looking in. And I don't care about that. I'm good with uh, trying to figure out where to go. I say we go... Ooh. Cashier's area? Oh, look at that. I say we go right in there. That that sounds like a fantastic idea. That gives me a chance to use my new... Oh, I love that pickaxe. Oh, that is just marvelous. What are you, magnum parts? I'm pretty sure my magnum parts are better than that. But you know what? I'll go ahead and take that. Definitely take some lead. Of course, I'm looking for all the lead, brass, etc. that I can find. I might actually be looking for as much metal as I can find because making the steel stuff is not cheap. I'll go ahead and search these pill cases because there may be stuff I want. I don't really care about the plain bandages. Those don't really matter. I will take all the alcohol I can get, though, because, of course, they used that during the 21-day hoard. So I am all about using the alcohol if uh, given the opportunity. There we go. We'll go ahead and reload some of our supplies that way. That's not too shabby. Okay. Now, let's just see. What are you going to do damage-wise? Hmm. Alrighty. Wall safe. And you have a crappy hunting rifle stock that no one cares about. Okay. So I believe there was a staircase over here in the lobby. Why don't we go upstairs? What do you say? What do you say we go upstairs? I'm just taking one more quick look back here. Uh, that's pretty close to where we came in, too. So, yeah, we'll go ahead and head upstairs now. I suspect there may be someone upstairs at some point. I, I don't really know. It's part of the joy here is I feel like this is kind of new. I don't really know what to expect everywhere. That's pretty awesome. With so many things in this game, I just kind of know what's coming and, you know, what to expect. Even if, you know, obviously you can't know every little thing just because... Um, did I bring one of those with me? Huh, I didn't. I'm going to go ahead and take that and hold on to it. But after you play for a while, you kind of get to know the standard 
kind of stuff to expect, and that's that's definitely where I'm at with this game. I've been playing it long enough that I kind of know what to expect in most places, so this is kind of cool. I don't know what to expect in here. I mean, I have my guesses, but um, yeah, this is pretty cool. I'm, I'm digging this. Gotta say, though, this is a pretty tiny hospital if there's, you know, really only one room over there. Maybe there'll be more rooms upstairs. I don't know. Locked door. I know how to get through locked doors. It's called use my steel pickaxe. Nope. They don't technically know where I'm where I'm at yet. They might know I'm around. They don't know I'm here. Specifically speaking. Yeah, I'm just collecting all this junk. We'll go ahead and we'll we'll scrap it in a little while. It's okay. This would be a totally cool building to, to just kinda stock up in, you know, kind of hang out in. I know some people do that. I've never done that. I think that might be kind of fun thing to try. I don't know that I'll end up playing Nava's Gone again, or that this will end up in random gen, so it's entirely possible that might not happen. Iron Arrowhead. Oh, you know what? That does remind me. We do have something to be doing here, so let's go ahead and get those crafted up. Let's go ahead and start on that. I forgot to do that. We have a bunch of steel bolts that we put together, but uh, kind of forgot to start the crafting portion of the game, so we should do that. Dog, you just growl. Says you don't know where I'm at, so shut up. Hunting rifle barrel. I'm pretty sure our hunting rifle barrel is better, and if not, that's close enough that I'm not really concerned about scrapping that one, so we can do that. Of course, we're not going to be able to scrap anything for a little while here, and I just created a problem for myself because I now need to scrap a bunch of things. So let's go ahead and stop that, and then... Oh, let's see. Let's scrap you. Scrap you. Scrap you, scrap you, scrap that guy, and scrap that guy, and scrap those guys, and then get back to making steel crossbow bolts. Oh, I dropped my steel arrowheads. I'm glad I just realized that. And then make those again. There we go. So I can grab those. <laughs> That's all that was about, was just being able to grab that lead right there. And I guess technically open up a couple inventory spots, so, you know, that, that kind of worked. We'll say that worked out just fine. That dog is just not giving up, is he? Or she. I don't know what that dog is. Other than it's not a dog that gives up easily. Give up, dog! You're not going to get me! I see some pill cases. Let's check these guys out. Is this supposed to be like a little vending machine for pill cases or just like a little storage closet, I would imagine? Guessing that's what it is. I probably didn't bring much for food and water on me. Oops! Here, we'll go ahead and drink that. And that. I think I might have some food on the bike. And if not, uh, you know. It's a hospital. Seems like it should have some food somewhere. Maybe there's a cafeteria somewhere. If not, whatever. We can, you know. We can totally take care of things. It's not a big deal. I wonder if you just heard that little jingle. If you did, kind of like da da na na na. Uh, that was Adobe saying that I have Creative Cloud updates that I've been ignoring for probably a couple of days now. So I probably need to take care of those at some point here. So, but not right now. We're we're busy. We're doing stuff. We're checking this place out. How are we doing on the steel crossbow bolt front? We have a ways to go, so I cannot scrap those sunglasses, because I don't really feel like doing the juggle again. Really don't. It's going to have to be something good if you want me to juggle. Nope, that's not it. Nice try. Nice try with your fancy pants and your fancy coat. Not good enough, though. Beverage cooler. All right, hook it up with the water. I suppose we could always drop some, some empty jars. We don't really need to carry them around, but, ah, uh, you know, doesn't hurt to have them does not hoit to have them. What you got in there for me? Ah, crap. I actually would kind of like that. Uh, we're almost there, so remind me to check that. We'll, we'll check that in just a minute. Wow, oh, look at that. There are a lot of cans in here. I mean, I guess it adds up, right? Oh, there's another, another wrench there. All right, let's go ahead and start scrapping this junk. Scrap you. Scrap that guy. And I guess I forgot to do that one earlier, so oh well. Scrap those. And I don't want to scrap my sledgehammer. We might still use that. You never know. I'll grab you. Sure, why not? Is there a gun? Oh, gun. There's a trash can right there, though. 
All right, it's cool. That's cool. I wonder if this game will ever have doors on the bathrooms. It always just feels a little weird to me that there, there, there are no doors. I don't think the engine is necessarily set up for it. That's part of the problem. Or that they just haven't made the the assets for it. And, you know, whatever. It's fine. It's not a big deal. It just... Just saying. I'm just wondering. I'm just curious. That's all. That is all. Ah, uh, sure. We'll go ahead and take that. I guess I can take that, that one there. And then we'll take that in there. All right. Fine. Why not? All right. We're going to scrap that guy down. Scrap these down. And I should probably stop collecting all this junk. But the truth is, I actually can use all this metal. So it's actually working out pretty well. I'll try to be a little quicker about it, though. Oh, look at you. Aren't you a sight for sore eyes? So we can scrap that one and scrap that one. Man, we're finding nothing but orange stuff right now, it seems. It's all orange. At least where the tool front is concerned. Orange tools! Orange tools! Must have been a big sale at, uh, I don't know. Mm, Ace Hardware. Home Depot. Lowe's. Osh. I don't know. One of those places had a sale on orange stuff. Must be Home Depot, because that would be orange, right? Their colors are orange. Yeah, if you're not in the U.S., you probably don't know what Home Depot is. My apologies. And you're not really missing out on much. It's just a big hardware store. That's all it is. That's all it is. All right, enough with the bathrooms, all right? Enough with the bathrooms. We get it. We know what a bathroom is. We don't need to go looking through the toilets. It's kind of gross. It's unnecessary. Check. Nope, we don't need to check you out. Never mind. Oh. I just rocked that floor without even meaning to. Oh, I'll go ahead and take that. And we'll take that. Sure, it's cool. Is there anything else over here? There is one more room. I'm going to assume you are locked. Survey says... Door opens in one swing. This is a big office. With not much in it. Someone has a bit of a, you know minimalist theme going on here. Let me scrap some of this junk. Scrap you, scrap you, and I think we're looking pretty good right now. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. I'm going to go ahead and drink that one just as we run along here and head upstairs. I don't know how many more floors we have to go. That's um, kind of cool, though. I like that. I'm digging this. I am really enjoying this. This is really cool here. Oh, I think we might be at the top. Are we? I think that's the top. Now, is there roof access? I would assume there is. Oh, no. We can still go up a floor. All right. It's cool. That is cool. Oh, we got another cashier-y type place, maybe. Crunch. And there goes your reinforcements. And then there goes that one. And crunch. There goes your reinforcements again. There go your reinforcements. Hmm, yeah, whatever. Anyway. Lots of bandages. We'll take all of those guys. I don't know that I really need all these um, first aid kits. You might disagree with that assessment. Actually, you know what I should do, and I meant to do this, and I just didn't. We should eat those guys, because that's food. So we'll go ahead and eat that one. That's food. I was just saying earlier that, you know, it didn't really bring any food with me. I think there's some on the bike. I mean, there's still a ton of corn on the bike, and if I'm really getting hungry here, all I have to do is go outside and grab a bunch of corn, so... It's not like there isn't anything around. I just, uh, you know, whatever. I just figure, hey, this is free food right here. We don't get any wellness from it, but that's okay. We do get the fullness, so... We are apparently a vampire today. Based upon how much blood we have already eaten. I guess we can take that. Do you have anything interesting? Come on! Gotta say, thus far, in terms of loot, i am been a little underwhelmed. Earlier in the game, this would have been really incredible stuff. So, part of that's my fault for waiting so long. Let's go across the the way here. Oh, there are a couple of doors around. Oh, look at this. Got some cabinets. Let's, um... Let's say that's the last cabinet we're going to check. I'm, I'm kind of running out of interest to check those. Just because I already know what kind of stuff we're going to find in there. It's not going to be particularly interesting. Ah, there we go. It's about time someone has some ammo squirreled away in a hospital. I think they'd never seen an American TV show. Oh, look at that. It's morning. I didn't even realize. I'll check the sink. Hey, look at that. 
something that isn't orange. And I know, we should probably keep that one because it's in much better condition, but it's too late. I already did it. And we'll take that one and use the vitamins. Just because... Oh, I guess we should go ahead and eat another blood bag. Or Nope, wrong button. We're about full on the empty jar front. How are we doing over here? This is an interesting room. Uh, yeah, you know what? Scrap that guy. Those ones are kind of good. That's why I'm checking the sink here. Scrap you and scrap you. Because those tools add up. Those pots add up. So those are, I think, are worth checking. Should have another, I guess, an exam room over here. There's a bag. I like the sports bags. Except when they have garbage in them. All right, we can go ahead and eat that. Whatever. We're actually getting pretty close on food here at this point. That's kind of funny. We're going to end up being full from eating blood, I think. Maybe not. I just, I think there's a definite possibility, though. Oh, look at you. You're actually better, again, than the one we already had. Just going to take that out. We'll, we'll scrap that down in a minute. I'm just trying to keep moving on here. Trying to keep moving along. I hope these are garage ones. Ah, that's a shame. The cardboard ones are not as interesting as garage boxes. They don't have the same loot table, or at least they didn't used to have the same loot table. I, I can't say for certain that they don't have the same loot table. I just, I don't believe they do. Uh, you know what? Here, let's drop that in there. And uh, actually, you know what? We'll just take that. Never mind, I am at 100% fullness, so, or uh, waterness, so I cannot drink anymore. I am fully hydrated. There is no need for additional water. BDU top. If we switch that out. Brrr, that technically is better, even if it's worse. Kind of don't want to get rid of that, but I don't really have a lot of ballistic fiber to repair it. I think that's what it takes. I'll have to take a look at that again. Here, let's uh, scrap you. So if I want to repair this. No, it does repair with cloth fragments. Why was I thinking it was ballistic fiber? I don't know. 278. That's better than the one we just picked up. So we'll go ahead and scrap that. And scrap that, because that'll break down into a bunch of brass. That'll be handy dandy. Even though we can't really do a whole lot with brass right now, I must admit. That is kind of a disappointment. It's okay. It's not a big deal. Just checking the sinks because we got some good stuff out of them before. We'll use that and take that. And we'll just go and scrap those two because they're right there, ready, good to go. Take you. We are up to a few of those guys, which is good. Liking that. I'm liking that thus far. Okay. A little small room here. Not much of interest in here thus far. Found quite a few schematics, which is good for just pumping up our skills, but it doesn't really have a whole lot of long-term effect, if I'm going to be honest here. Oh. Look at this. This is nice. I like this. I like this a lot. This is really cool. Oh, yeah, I like this. This is this is good stuff. Madam! Yeah, I totally missed. Can I... Oh, hi, dog. Whatever. You guys just... You go do your zombie thing out there. I want to go up to the roof. Because I think that's all that remains. And uh, I probably will use the rest of these crossbow bolts. Be pretty liberal with applying them to the zombies' faces and other body parts. Oh, backpack. Definitely check the backpack. But I would like to go ahead and get us switched over here pretty shortly to the steel ones. That would be that would be nice. That That is definitely the goal. Did I forget to check a body somewhere? I get the feeling I did. Maybe I didn't. I get the feeling I saw a corpse somewhere and I didn't check him. Hmm. I hope I didn't forget to do that. I'm kind of tempted to take those steel arrows and just combine them with the ones we have. Not that we need them, but just because I kind of... Oh, yeah, look at that. There's the rest of the... Ouch, don't break anything. Roof access. Well, that's good I didn't break anything, but that actually is slightly problematic for getting back in. Your oops. All right, well, this is why I carry frames, because sometimes I do dumb things and I need to uh, climb back up. 
So we'll do something like that. And then we're going to pick you up. And I think we can do this. I'm not sure. We'll find out. And, uh, nope. I was thinking it might be a little higher than I'm not. All right, well, whatever. We can make a frame and still get out of here. It's not a big deal. Craft one. I mean, in fact, I'd, I'd actually like to have a bunch more anyway, so... This works out well. This just is an excuse to make more frames. Yoink, 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 yoink. So I think with that, um, I want to go ahead and get out of here. I will check that one corpse that I think I forgot to check. It would be on this level, and it would be, I don't know, right over here, actually, I think. Somewhere? I don't know where it was. Whatever. If I don't remember or I don't see the room I'm looking for, I'm not going to worry about it. I just don't care that much. Um, did I totally miss this part? I guess I did. Well, open up then. Oh, wow, yeah. I totally missed a, a good chunk here. But it looks like it's all stuff we've already looked through, so I'm not really going to worry too much about it. And I will catch you on the next one. I don't know where that's going to be just yet. I guess we'll find out. I'm going to put you back, and we'll eat some more blood here, because um, getting hungry. Getting hungry in the cold. Getting hungry in the cold. So I'll catch you on another one. Until then, thanks for watching. See you later.